Hey guys, Mike Miner here. Another cool stuff today regarding BIOS mod in Hive OS. So this only applies for cards like uh, 470, RX 470, RX 570, and RX 580. Irregardless whether it's a 4 GB card or it's an 8 GB card. So the first step that you need to do is you need to log into Hive OS and then uh, you must go to your rig which are having uh, amd cards let's say for example my current uh, rig that has amd cards are as follows we have i have rig 002 and rig 009 but currently i'm ha i'm already happy on my setup on on rig 002 which is currently mining on ethereum so i just have to share with you regarding the the rig 009 which is running on uh, which is mining on ergo and it's mining also easel or zilica so it's a dual mining but if you don't try to 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 bios mod these cards uh, it won't give you it will not try to maximize on its it's maximize its own hash rate potential so let's say we go to my rig 9 here and currently all, all all of these cards are already uh is already bios mod so that's why we are having a maximum here of 62 mega hash but normally these cards would mine only at about 40 mega hash so but some of the cards i i try to power limit because i got limitation in my house for the if i try to max out all of the power on my trip off so i want i want it to be more stable instead of compromising my uh, power so one example here i'm gonna show you in bios mod so you got to go to overclocking then you have here download v bios so you just press this download v bios and then you get to select which card you want to to mod modify so you must be very careful guys in 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 trying to mod or or trying to apply later on because each and every card is different so you must mod one at a time only so slowly but surely so let's say for example i'm gonna bios mod here the rx 470 uh lpda lpda ew4032 babg then but then i have another here which is uh, rx470 samsung so you see it's a different uh it's a different type of card so let's say for example i'm gonna select gpu zero and then just press download after it tries to successfully download bios it will create this kind of uh, line in here which is the rig 009 mpc2 so what you need to do is just press this in order for you to get the file so now we have the file here locally it's in my local folder so once you have successfully downloaded the file you may be able to to bios mod the file by running a Polaris BIOS editor. So it's a software that it can only be run in a Windows environment. So I will try to leave a description link regarding where you can download this uh, Polaris editor. Mm -hmm. So once you have downloaded the Polaris editor, uh, you can be able to run it and then we'll just have to say no and then the file that we have downloaded is you just have to press uh, open bios and you need to locate the, the file that we have downloaded so this is the one and then uh, it's a one click time patching so we click this one click time and just press ok and press ok and then press no you don't need to buy the pro version because it's for free you can still make use of the full functionality 
as soon as you have pressed the one one click timing patch then you will be able to press this save as to file and you can name this as uh, as per existing file and then uh, you can put maybe a additional mod in front and just press save so once you have downloaded the file or once you have modded the file you need to go to you need to go back to hive os and then try to 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 flush the vbios so how to flash the vbios is uh, we still need to go same place overclocking and we press uh, flash bios flash bios and we select the file the modded file and so this is the file that we have selected and then we press upload and then we select the gpu that we need to flash so the so you must be very careful in flashing you might be flashing the wrong gpu so there's a reference here the name is 470 radeon 580 so 4 glp the EW, so it's a correct file this is the one that we did use in the flashing a while ago so after that you take this one force uh, flashing ignoring security checking and then you press upload so but since my my gpu has already been flashed so i no need to do this so once you have uploaded uh the rig will try to restart Try to allow it to restart and then after you have uh, restarted your rig then uh, you can see the difference uh, on on the, the, the hashing of your or gpu so uh thanks for watching guys this is another episode of uh, mike miner i hope that you learned something on flashing your your gpu amd gpu using uh the high of hive os utility and uh please support me guys for more uh videos please uh try to subscribe and then uh push the notification bell for any new contents that we will be sharing so you will be notified first thanks goodbye